Oh, what's good, G-Life? It's your boy, MC Shadow, back at you with another video. Make sure you guys like, comment, and are subscribed to the channel. It's absolutely free. That is how you help my channel get into the algorithm. Highly appreciate if you go ahead and do that. Don't forget to check out my second channel, Man of Society MOD. That's where we, you know, go live and talk about, you know, everything and anything. Now, what I've been getting asked is what are my thoughts on this Valenzuela gangs, you know, taking over Colorado and, you know, other, you know, cities or states within the United States, you know, what I think that's all about. And if I believe it, right, with the whole angels and I don't know what, right, people were letting me know. So I looked into it. And now, just to make it clear, I am not a Republican. I am not a Democrat. I am not a liberal. I am not a conservative. I don't believe in no politics. And I am not a fan of neither uh, person running for presidency, right, before. Because I know I always get people saying, oh, you're taking one side or defending one side. No, 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 no. I defend no side because I see them all equally as bad. Right. It's just that Republicans just make it very, very hard, you know, to, you know, not point out their, you know, shit. I do it on I do it on Democrats, too. Right. So it's an even playing field. But it's just, you know, one side tends to be coming with the fuckery more than the other. <laughs> now, the reason I say that is because I believe that this is all publicity, you know, it's publicity that's been happening you know for quite some time when it comes to the border right and immigrants coming over here right it's been a main focus point when it comes to these political uh agendas right especially from donald trump's camp you know donald trump's uh somebody who's been advocating this uh illegal invasion of these criminals that are looking to take over the united states i mean you know when he was running before one of, his, one of his main um, arguments was these caravans that are coming from Central America. These caravans, you know, full of all kinds of criminals. These caravans that were looking to invade, right? And they will show video of these all these people marching to the borders. Yet, we never heard anything from these caravans, right? They kind of just disappeared and, you know, nobody ever brought them up ever again. Like, whatever happened to those caravans of these people that were marching over here? That's a very good question. It seems like they've seen that it doesn't, it wasn't working, so they went with a, <laughs> a different argument, right? And that's what I feel like, you know, is happening now, right? Before it was this invasion of, you know, caravans, and that's why they need to vote for Trump, but obviously Trump didn't win. So now the argument has to be that they're already over here, and they're, look, they're invading and taking over and these Venezuela gangs and yada, yada, yada. Well, you know damn well law enforcement was going to let that happen, right? And these gangs don't hold power like that where they could just come and take over shit like that, bro. There's been gangs here in the United States for so long, bro. And powerful ones, too. Let me add that, right? And haven't been able to do what these Valenzuela gangs are already doing. <laughs> when these motherfuckers are rooted, have connections, and are well more connected here than the Valenzuela ones. But, but they can't do what the Valenzuela ones already have done. I just, you know, someone from the coming from the street world, bro, it, it's, it's just not happening. <laughs> but propaganda is going to push it like that. That way people will go vote for these individuals to build a stronger border and, you know, stop this from happening. Now, I feel like the Hell's Angel was just added by some troll out there. They're not going to go and defend nothing, bro. They're just a gang that's looking to profit as well, bro. Relax. They're not no fucking superheroes fighting for the greater good. <laughs> right? And plus, you know... American gangs would probably see them as a threat and would want to, you know, go combat them just sheer on the fact of they're invading their territory. So it wasn't going to go lovely for them. So, but it was going to be a power struggle over the same thing, not for no benefit of, you know, civilians. And that's just the truth of things, right? So that part was just a troll in my, in my personal opinion, right? Somebody just said that and people ran with it. Um, but I feel like this is just another, you know, you know, politician, you know, propaganda. That way people go and vote for people to put stronger borders and, and stuff like that because obviously these criminals are already here and they're looking to do this, this, and that. We, right before it was the caravans coming over here, but now it's these criminals are already here, so we got to, you know, vote for the right people. <laughs> it's propaganda, bro. That's just my personal opinion of what's going on and what do I think is the real motive and and what's really happening, you know. But what are your thoughts? Leave it in the comments, Shadow, we up.